Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to learn how we can use accordion component of material UI in React. So for that, I have created a new component in which I will do the coding for that. And I already imported this here inside the app component. Now I just start to import first of all box component from MUI. Now I just convert this box and now I use here typography. So I say MUI typography and I pass here uh, H4 and uh, I remove this color, no need of it. And I pass here MUI accordion example save this now here i need to import accordion also so i say accordion and i use this component inside this i use accordion summary and accordion details so here i have a summary also so inside this summary i use a typography so i say mui typography and here i pass a h5 and uh, i can say color here to text dot secondary now text dot secondary now here i say accordion one for example save this now i pass accordion summary also so i say accordion detail also after the summary in, in this accordion details, I will insert a typography for detail information. So I say this is body2 in typography and color. It doesn't require any color right now here. Now I pass here dummy text. So I say lorem multiply by 2 or we can say 1 and tab. So we have some dummy text also. You see that now I see here we have accordion example, but we have to design more. So I say uh, this to alignment to the center, save this. Now we have uh, the center, we have accordion also, but this accordion is not looking accordion. So we have to design for that. For that, uh, what I do, I just insert and these accordions uh, inside a box so i say one more box here and i just cut this and i paste after this save this now this box layout i just pass here uh, margin so i try to give margin to and see if there yeah we have the now some effect now i need to insert icon also for that expand icon in uh, summary for that i just go here in material ui icon website and here i say expand icon so expand more this icon i require so i copy this then i just import this like that now i use this in summary i say expand icon and here i use this expand more icon like that save this and you see that as a output we have this icon here you see it's working now uh, i can make copy of multiple accordions also uh, like that i say copy then paste then paste then save and you see that we have three accordions like this you see they're working and i say one two three so i change the name this is the one and this is two this is three save this you see it is working perfectly if you see the example here i click on three accordions and all three are open right now this is the by default nature of this accordions but we can change this 
nature also that i want only one accordion should open and remaining two should close if i click on two then one or three should close automatically if i click on third then two and one should close automatically if i click on one then two and three should close automatically it means at a time only one accordion should be open so what we can do for this that we are going to learn here uh, we can provide a, a text color also you see here i am not able to do text color so i see here the color now i see it changing or not yeah it is changing text color is not working so we can provide here color to all as a secondary like that you see i save this and you see we have the color also we have icon also these icon color we can also change because uh, it's a simple component and i can say color and here if i say the color is secondary save this you see this color is changed so like that we can change color also so i can provide this color here also and here also save this and you see that we all have a icon also we have colorful icon we can change text to color also that is easy you can do yourself now we should learn how we can control this only single accordion should be open for that uh, i need one property that is expanded expanded and this property should have a true and false value if i say it is true that means automatically this will if i refresh it so automatically first would be open you see because of this property so if i say false then it would not be open at a starting point so we have to manage this property how we can manage this property this property can be managed by on change event for that we need one state variable so i create this variable first of all const expand set expand and here i say use state state variable now i manage it that if this expand value is equal to equal to 1 then we can say that it is true and we manage this by using on change event and remember that this on change event will have a function uh, that will have two value first is the event and second is boolean value that is is expand means it is expanded or not so we call this to handle i say handle expand function and this function i pass is expand first of all it is true or false if you click on this it would be true and here i am passing a value 1 remember that 1 now i just save this and we have to create this function so i create this function here i say const handle expand equal to and this function have first boolean value is expand second is the value which i am passing the name of the accordion now i say set expand and that expand is depend on the value of is expand i say is expand is true then we pass here the value which we are passing otherwise we say false remember if it is true then we pass value otherwise we say false now i just copy these two properties in other accordions also so here we should copy and i change it to two second accordion here also i pass it to two then i paste here also and here i say it is three and here i pass three save this and you will see that now if i refresh i click here one open i click on second you see one is closed automatically i click on third second is closed automatically i click on one third is closed automatically click on second one is closed click on one second is closed that means only one 
component will open at a time not all other accordions will open so it's such kind of activity or such kind of events we can handle by using this expanded property and the on change function in which we are passing an event and we passing a true or false value if we click hit it will be true so we are passing this and we are passing the notation of this component and we are matching here that if it is true if it is true then pass the value which we are passing otherwise false if the condition is match we are passing a one then it will match with one so that means true so you are clicking on this that is true all remaining are false so these are false so they will these will cl close automatically now it is true all other are closed so they will close and it will open so this is the way to use accordions components in material ui and lot more things are also available as per the requirement suppose you want to give uh, some id to this or some name to this so you can provide here id like i give here and i say a chord one like that we can pass chord one like this we can pass id and uh, we can pass aria label also so we say aria label like that and aria control whatever you want to give we say a chord one so like that we can provide some additional information also and these are required for identifications of your coding so like that you can give these value to accordion 2 and accordion 3 also but if you require otherwise my work is doing like without without using these property i am able to do this but if you require in any means you can use it so more properties are also available not only this one but as per the application requirement we can use it but in this example my requirement is just to give you an overview of accordions components so you just start to use these if you require in your application like that you can do your task as i explain in this video i think you understand it now if you understand it please do subscribe thank you for watching this video